In a battle royale for the most powerful animal, what species would win? The Asian elephant? The tiger? The saltwater crocodile? Evolution has nudged wild creatures to hone their blows, bites, and brute strength for survival. But in the end, who puts the king in animal kingdom depends on what kind of strength you're looking at. The red kangaroo's kick delivers a bone-shattering 759 pounds of force. The average human gym rat, who lacks the training to focus their blow, would be kicked out faster than a bad guy in a Bruce Lee film. But a Taekwondo master with a black belt, one with a 136 mile per hour kick that hits opponents with 2,300 pounds of force, might just go toe to paw with the roux in the ring. An Asian elephant's trunk has 150,000 muscles. That nose alone can move 770 pounds. It's strong enough to uproot a tree. But in 2016, English strongman Eddie Hall set the current world record for a deadlift by hoisting 1,102.3 pounds, more than the weight of a concert grand piano. A Tasmanian devil can open its jaws 80 degrees to chomp carrion snacks or rivals' faces. But that's nothing compared to the saltwater crocodile. The croc has a literal ton of brute force in its jaw, 2,020 pounds of bite force. That's more than six times its closest competitor, the tiger. The biggest animals often weigh the most, making them relatively weak for their size. A mantis shrimp, on the other hand, delivers a punch with a force more than 3,000 times its weight. And a ribbited mite, which is shorter than a tenth of an inch, can bench press nearly 1,200 of its fellows. So what species is the strongest animal? Humans who properly trained won two out of our four competitions, so Homo sapiens technically take the title. But if you're not a world record holder for strength or haven't spent decades mastering a fighting form, maybe avoid tiffs with red kangaroos, elephants, crocodiles, and mantis shrimp. <laughs>